And our final contestant of Group 3 is from Latvia. My name is Daniela and I'm proud to represent my majestic country Latvia, which is going to celebrate its 100th year of independence. Latvia is one of the greenest places in Europe with 54% of its entire area covered in forests, which really makes me happy as I frequently go on walks and runs to work out and enjoy the nature here. I also hold a strong passion for music. Growing up, I attended the music school where I learned to play the saxophone and piano. I'm currently in the final year of my undergraduate degree in political science and international relations. In high school, I had a great ambition to improve the medical industry since I was familiar with the issues people are facing worldwide and it is difficult for some of them to afford medical health care. Around 400 million people don't have access to simple health care at all. I was able to gather this knowledge due to the vast resources available in the National Library of Latvia. Therefore, I pursued a project in biomedical engineering. It won the first place in Latvia and together with my teammate we were allowed to represent Latvia at the Young Scientist Contest in Brussels. We were invited to present this project in Intel ISEF in Los Angeles. I have always believed that if you can dream it, you can achieve it. Latvia, why did you choose political science and international relations? Thank you for your question. You know, I have always had this interest in global affairs worldwide. So at some point I just realized that there aren't so many female leaders in this field. And I thought that it's time to change that. In fact, only 23% of all world politicians are female. And you know, female are more compassionate, we are more willing to compromise, we are more empathetic, and we are great role models for children. So my main purpose for studying political science and international relations is to prove everyone that women can be great leaders, listeners, collaborators, and motivate others by their actions. And do you hope to lead Latvia one day? I do hope so. <laughs> Well, good luck, Latvia, and congratulations, contestants. That concludes the video presentations.